Hi, I'm Kirsten Duke and welcome to Racing Passport. Over the years, just nine Colts have scored the Newmarket and Irish 2000 Guineas double, with Churchill being the most recent to do so back in 2017. This year, we don't have a competitor going for the double, but we do have a couple of Newmarket Quipco Guineas place getters. One of those being Royal Scotsman, who's yet to score his first Group 1 win, but has certainly been knocking on the door. Watch this horse in this replay in the pink and green silks just over here and watch the way he pushes on home. Jacket on the far side trying to run on his noble style. High roll wandering in front there from Chaldean. Chaldean with every chance. Royal Scotsman now coming through well on the stand side with Sakia. The favourites well beaten. Both the O'Brien horses well beaten. They run into the dip. Chaldean far side. High roll just can't run straight. Then behind those Royal Scotsman and noble style and Dubai Mall. Chaldean on the far side out in front. The Dewhurst winner in the hands of Frankie Notori in his final season. And he wins another Guineas! Keldean wins it from High Royal, then Royal Scotsman, type of Hawk Gatteron. This Colt has placed in his last two Group 1 efforts and punters have faith he can score the win this weekend as they've backed him into favourite position on the New South Wales tab. A horse I'm keen to keep an eye on at slightly juicy rods is Donica O'Brien trained Proud and Regal, who's coming off the back of a third placing last start. Now, don't let this raise your eyebrows. Just two starts back, this Galileo Colt won the Group 1 Criterium at St. Cloud. Watch this horse in those purple and white silks. It's the chestnut horse just on the outside. Followed then by Bray Sky. Salt Bay is there. And now Kubrick in the two shades of green is coming through on the far side. It's a line of three as they race to the 300. On the near side, Espionage. In the centre is Salt Bay. Far side is Kubrick. Trying on the near side is Proud and Regal in the purple and is coming home strongly. Proud and Regal out after Espionage. Espionage in front. Proud and Regal tries to peg him back. Espionage digs deep. Proud and Regal is going to lunge right on the line it's a heads up heads down bobber oh great finish espionage the far side proud and regal the near side there is not a breath in this last preparation this colt one second up so i have faith that this could be a similar this time around which is why i have him as my value bet best of course royal scotsman i think is going to be the bridesmaid no more and hopefully get the job done to get that group one win but potential to cause an upset that's proud and regal